Hello. Today, the Home Affairs Select Committee will be launching its new conference, Leadership in the Police, which will take place on the 14th of January next year in the Palace of Westminster. The landscape of policing has altered in a dramatic way. Out goes the serious and organised crime agency, in comes the National Crime Agency. Out goes the National Policing Improvement Agency, in comes the College of Policing. CEOP has been moved from a standalone organisation into a new agency which some have said is the equivalent of the FBI. These are dramatic changes for policing in England and Wales. At our conference, we will be hearing from a number of distinguished speakers, the President of Interpol, the Commissioner of the Metropolis, Bernard Hogan Howe, Lord Gorman, Gordon Wasserman, who has been advising the government on policing issues for some time, and many others. Only yesterday, I asked the Prime Minister about the a number of chief constables who have either retired or are about to retire from our police forces. And as we all know, at the end of November, we elected police and crime commissioners throughout England and Wales. There has never been a time, certainly since Sir Robert Peel started policing in Britain in a modern and dynamic way, where the landscape has changed so dramatically. We start with our seminar, we go on to our inquiry, and we hope to publish our report later in the year. As part of that process, we want to consult with all of you. The public, because you are the people being policed. The police, because they are going to implement the government's policy. Those practitioners and academic experts who can provide us with detailed background information and finally the Home Secretary and other Ministers. We will produce a comprehensive report which we hope will inform the government about its changes. This is a dramatic shift in the landscape of policing. I want you to be part of that.